Ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, as the principal of Roseville High School, it is my pleasure to welcome all of you to the commencement for the class of 2015. With the exception of the Star Spangled Banner, with the exception of the Star Spangled Banner and during the placement of the flags by the Roseville Police Department Honor Guard, we ask that all guests remain seated during the duration of the ceremony. Your graduates' pictures will be projected on a large screen, both sides of the auditorium, and you may take pictures from your seats. Please remain at attention for the national anthem and the whole time that the Honor Guard is placing the flags until they exit the stage. Gentlemen, please remove your caps. Please stand for the anthem. Honor guard, left, face. Forward, march. Please be seated. <laughs> once again, once again, welcome. Welcome to the commencement ceremonies for the Roseville High School class of 2015. Thank you for attending. As we begin this evening, there are a few requests and reminders for your safety and the safety of others around you, please do not block any aisles or doorways. If you need to use the restroom or step out of the main auditorium at any time, please use the doors on the sides. We've worked very hard tonight to put together a beautiful event for our students and for their families. And I would like to take a moment now to thank some very important people that made this possible. First and foremost, I would like to thank my secretary and one of our lead teachers, Mr. John Chuck, my secretary, Ms. Sally Bomarito, for organizing the ceremony and making all of the things go smoothly. Thank you very much.
Please hold your applause to the rest of this list. <laughs> to all the staff serving as readers and ushers. To Mr. James Dunn and his staff here at Bethesda. To our Board of Education for making this venue possible for the school. To Mr. Cheshire and Ms. Collins for the beautiful music from the choir and band program. To our junior class top 10 students serving as honor guard and ushers tonight. Don't they look pretty sharp in their tuxedos? And also, I'd like to pay special acknowledgement to this year's top 10 students that were last year's honor guard. And this year, by their suggestion, our top 10 students are all wearing purple cords so that they can be recognized as well. Finally, I would like to thank my family for giving me the opportunity to be not only the principal, but also a parent of the class of 2015. Thank you. This venue is extremely comfortable and conducive to a very special ceremony. And we believe that the expense to be here is warranted because we can be certain, rain or shine, hot or cold, that you will be comfortable and safe. We need everyone's cooperation to make this evening successful. As each child crosses the stage, it is critical that we're able to clearly hear their name. Every parent watching wants to hear their child's name we're videotaping for cable TV and to give you copies of that as well. We ask that during the roll call, during the roll call there is no calling out of names, shouting out, whistling or cheering. At the end of each small section, we'll give you an opportunity to applaud and to cheer and to show your joy. But we cannot do that while we are calling names in the section or someone's name will not be heard. By cooperating with this request, and showing restraint during each small section. The program will move smoothly, every name will be heard, and you will be able to cheer for everyone at the end of their section. For those of you with small children here tonight, please do not fret if they get a little bit fussy and make a little bit of noise. For we are in the business of children, and that will not bother us one bit. When the roll call is complete, and the graduation is done, Please stay in your seats so that the graduates can march out for the recessional. Then you may exit to the auditorium and meet your child out in front. Please remember that during the roll call, hold your applause to the end of each small section. Follow this request so we don't prevent other families from hearing their child's name. At this time, it is with great enthusiasm that I ask our Outstanding Teacher of the Year, Ms. Christine Anderson, math teacher, calculus teacher, and founder of the Roseville Regatta, to introduce our honor students. Ms. Anderson. Roseville High School is proud to present Kara Jean Hoffman as salutatorian for the class of 2015. Kara is the daughter of Gary and Dolores Hoffman and has three older brothers, Jeremy, Doug, and Mike. Kara is a member of the Roseville High School Marching Band, serving as section leader and National Honor Society serving as the Vice President her senior year. Kara is the recipient of the Presidential Award, Academic Letter, and Roseville Community Schools Scholarship Foundation Scholarship. In addition to her academic success, Kara volunteered at the Ronald McDonald House in Detroit and was a concession stand employee for Roseville Junior Sports. Kara will attend the University of Michigan Ann Arbor in the fall to prepare for a career in nursing. Kara. Good evening. Fellow classmates, today we are here to celebrate one of our greatest accomplishments. Graduating is no small feat. 
When we started high school four years ago, we were all so excited and a little bit scared. We were like saplings with so much room and time to grow. We were just tiny little freshmen with all these ideas in our heads of what high school was and how these next four years were going to go. For some of us, it went exactly how we imagined. For others, there were a lot of surprises. I know for me personally, it was a lot less scary than I originally thought. But I think I speak for everyone when I say that getting to this point wasn't always easy. Like trees, we have faced many different seasons, including some very dark winters. There were times when you and your best friend fought and you didn't know if you could get here without them. There were times when you were so overwhelmed with homework, you didn't know if it was worth it. There were times when outside issues were more important than school and it made graduation seem impossible. The hardships we faced in the process of getting here are not something to be brushed off or looked over. They are a part of our journey and a part of what made us who we are today. They are something to be proud of because we beat them. We beat the stress of too much homework. We beat the fatigue that comes with balancing school and sports. We beat the disappointment that comes from failing a test, and we beat whatever else we were dealing with to be able to be here today. We planted our roots and continued to grow, even when the ground below us was hard and tough. We made it to spring. We are here today, and soon we will walk across the stage and receive our diplomas. We have spent the past four years working hard to get here. We must let ourselves be proud of that. We may have needed help, and that's okay. Take the time to be thankful for those who helped you grow, those who lifted you up when you were down. On behalf of this senior class, I'd like to thank those individuals, the parents, teachers, friends, and family who helped us get here today. They made sure that we had water during the droughts, and they made sure we had sunshine after the storms. Remember the hard winters, but also remember the bright summers when our leaves grew back and we stood strong again. Throughout these four years, there have been countless times when we laughed, when we smiled, when we made new friends. We have earned good grades, we have passed classes, our hard work has paid off, and we've had fun. The good moments from our high school experience hopefully outshine the rest and will always remind us that there are many more summers to come. So, be proud of yourself today. You have succeeded. Success is messy. It comes from conquering the challenges you face. It comes from learning from failure instead of being defined by it. And you have all done that. You have all learned the tools necessary to move past failure, and that is no easy thing to do. Over these past four years, we have all seen beautiful summers and frigid winters, but we still continue to grow. We are no longer saplings. Today, we stand as redwoods. So after you walk across this stage and receive your hard-earned diploma, pat yourself on the back and tell yourself, good job. Your hard work has paid off. After that, remember your journey doesn't end here. There is still room in the sky for your branches to reach. Remember not to limit yourself. You have spent four years working towards this moment, sometimes fighting for it. Just imagine what else you will achieve. Could we have the senior members, the senior members singing with the choir, come up and join the choir?
Roseville High School is proud to present Nathan James Richendaller as valedictorian of the class of 2015. Nathan is the son of Melvin and Margaret Richendaller and has one brother, Nolan. Nathan is the recipient of the AP Scholar with Distinction Award, is a member of the Macomb County All Academic Team and has been a member of the All-A Honor Roll at Roseville High School for the past four years. Nathan is also the recipient of an academic letter and the Roseville Community School Scholarship Foundation Scholarship. In addition to his academic achievements, Nathan is a member of the varsity football team, Quiz Bowl, Ocean Bowl, Book Club, Science Olympiad, Eviathan, the Michigan Frog and Toad Survey, and the Community Garden Initiative. Nathan will attend Washington and Lee University to double major in politics and history. Nathan? Good evening. Friends, fellow students, countrymen, <laughs> lend me your ears, but only in the figurative sense of that expression. But in all seriousness, I suppose that you all here today expect that I will spend my time upon this podium lamenting the passing of these four years. And while it is most certainly true that I will have wistful nostalgia for this place from time to time, I don't believe that would be the most appropriate message for me to convey today. To do so would defy the dictionary. This is a commencement. To commence is not to end, it's not to relinquish, it's not to terminate. To commence is to begin. We're celebrating a beginning. A more forward-looking message is the one that I plan to deliver this day. And as for its length, for I've been told in the ballroom that there are some of you out there concerned that I would drone on for quite some time, <laughs> I can assure you it'll be a short message because as Thomas Jefferson once said, Speeches that are measured by the hour will die with the hour. We're about to embark on a voyage into the sea of our own independence and self-sufficiency, or so our parents sincerely hope. And on that voyage, we must chart a course ahead of time and stay dutiful to our plans, because as Yogi Berra once said, if you don't know where you're going, you'll end up someplace else. Over the course of the next four years, we're going to encounter hardships, and that is to be expected. But fortunately for us, we know where we're bound as a graduating class and as a generation overall. In the coming months, decades, teachers will become bosses. Good grades and awards will become promotions or bonuses if your boss isn't cheap enough and suspensions or detentions will become terminations of employment, unfortunately. Our generation will have to face such imposing issues as the mounting national debt, a world in constant conflict, and the reordering of our economy. But the bulk of our lives won't be spent thinking about these things, and we know that. The bulk of it will be spent thinking upon the affair of our own survival and prosperity. To this end, we will prevail because of the wisdom instilled in us by, first and foremost, our parents and also by Roseville High School. We will be in agreement with the words of George Washington when he said, if we cannot find wisdom from experience, it is hard to say where it may be found. Anytime the checkbook begins to look ugly, we can reflect upon the wisdom of Ms. Anderson, Mr. Skidmore, Mr. Hansen, or any of the other personal finance teachers. If only after we recall what Mr. Hansen's humorous backup plan for that checkbook might be, throw it out the window. When we're in our respective places of work and we're writing a report for, our, for the higher-ups in the company and we're trying to organize it in a coherent, cogent fashion, we can reflect upon the wisdom imparted to us by Mrs. Sheff, Mrs. Jordan, and any number of the other English teachers who taught us to be concise, not refer to ourselves in the writing, bury any weaker arguments in the middle, and hook the reader early. We owe much to our many teachers. We'll always remember the friends we had in high school, the clubs we were in, and the teams we were on. 
but the real intrinsic value of all those experiences is the character that it gave, it gave us to use as a foundation upon which to build a better life. As we make our way into adult lives, the high school mentality and approach to life will fade. As Bill Gates once put, once put it about the real world, the real world won't care about your self-esteem. It'll expect you to accomplish something before you feel good about yourself. In this brave new world into which we are entering, there is much danger, but there is also much opportunity. This is no time for trepidation on our part. With high school behind us, we will all be able to accomplish something. So let's get to it. God bless. Nathan for president. Could I please have the senior members of the band come up and join the band?
as that curtain closes, let's hear it for the choir and the band again. I frankly think every high school graduation deserves a little Led Zeppelin. Thank you, Mr. Cheshire. As the principal, it is my pleasure to assure the Board of Education and the entire community that each of our 365 graduates have met the requirements for graduation. Each of these young men and women have earned the required credits covering each ac academic area, as well as electives of their choosing and some of ours. They are ready to leave us and venture into the world filled with promise and challenge. And more so than at any other time in my experience as a principal, I can assure you that this class has truly grown up. You see, in the fall of 2011, the district was making many tough decisions in order to balance the budget. And during that year, an assistant principal position at Roseville High School went unfilled. Mr. Mickens and I, the athletic director, the building principal, both wore a hat as an assistant principal and we shared the academic and disciplinary concerns of these youngsters when they were freshmen. I'll tell you, looking back, it was a blessing and a burden, but remembering, I will always remember the blessings. I have witnessed their evolution from coming in that building in August as middle school children to turning into mature young men and women ready to go on in the world. It's been amazing. It's been an amazing four years to watch this class grow up after knowing them so well as freshmen. We were fortunate to share with them the thrills of athletics, the spirit of the student section, the music of the band and choir, the professionalism of WRHS and the Panther Prowl, now available online. We're in awe of the building trades homes, the cutting edge success of our auto tech, the woodworking and machinists taking the mites competition by storm, the beauty of the art program. We've gotten to see our students write books and set records. We've watched our students feed the needy and raise funds for others. And when the chips were down, when the politics of ranking schools had us pinned into a corner, this class in front of us right now raised us 22 points out of the bottom quartile and put us back on track. And we'll always be grateful for that. These students will make their way in the world as leaders, some as soldiers, as employees, entrepreneurs, as parents, and most importantly, as good people. Board President Janae, Without any hesitation, I present to you the class of 2015 for graduation. I'm actually kind of embarrassed to bring up this little piece of paper after listening to Nathan and not with a piece of paper, so bear with me. Thanks, Nathan. Good evening, everyone. I would like to begin by introducing all the board members um, with us tonight. Um, is our president, Vice President Alfredo Francisconi, uh, Secretary Greg Scott, Treasurer Matt McCartney, Trustees Kevin Swinowski, and Joe D. Felice. Ruth Green, um, who is uh, due to illness is unable to be with us tonight, but she sends her wishes to all of you. Well, class of 2015, you did it. You finally made it to this night. We're all very proud of you and your accomplishments. Through this past year, we have attended many activities, events, plays, programs, and award nights that made us proud of each and every one of you. As board members, we visit other schools throughout Macomb County, and none of them have anything on Roseville. You make us proud. We are our own best kept secret. As I recently went through your award-winning yearbook, congratulations, by the way, I noticed that your class song was Centuries by Fallout Boy. 
Believe it or not, I've heard the song many times, and I'd sing it for you, but I want to clear out the place. But I do want to share the chorus. Some legends are told, some to dust or to gold, but you will remember me, remember me for centuries. Is all it will take, and just one mistake is all it will take, will go down in history. Remember me for centuries, board. Hey, uh, oh, hey, hey, uh. <laughs> Remember me for centuries. <laughs> Class of 2015, go and do great things so you will all be remembered for centuries. Now, Principal Headmark, it is my honor and great privilege on behalf of this Board of Education to accept the 2015 graduating class of Roseville High School. They have successfully met the requirements set forth by the State of Michigan and Roseville Community Schools. Now, it's my pleasure to introduce our Superintendent, John Comment. Good evening, everyone. Parents, graduates, relatives, friends, and all the family, tonight is a special night for these graduating seniors. I am honored to be part of your ceremony. Parents, high school graduation, more than anything in our society, means that our babies are now adults. I know the feeling of graduating a child, actually six, and that I have gone through, and that and that you are probably going through tonight. The happiness, the joy, some sorrow, and probably a lot of relief. Your family, seniors, are extremely proud of you. Graduates, in about 30 minutes, this entire ceremony will be at the end. Handshakes, goodbyes, and probably even a few hallelujahs will take place. Graduates, I have no idea who spoke at my own graduation, and for sure I don't remember what he or she spoke about. I have a Twizzler for each and every one of you when you pick up your diplomas. <laughs> you may never remember what I'm talking about or who I am, but you'll say, he's the guy that gave me a Twizzler when I graduated. <laughs> Graduate, as I said, your parents are extremely prou proud of you. If you look at the diploma, as Nathan said, there's the word commencement. The reason this is for, referred to as a commencement, it is not an ending. It is a beginning. This is not about what you have done at Roseville High School, but it's where you're going from here on. In older days at commencements, graduates were referred to as commencers and delivered, each and every one of you would have to deliver an orientation speech to receive your diploma. I think you can see how long graduation would take place if there's 365 of you coming up here to speak. Today, your salutatorian, valedictorian, and president represent your class. Seniors, this is a fantastic day. You have achieved a milestone, 13 years of hard work, 13 years of memories, and friends that many of you will have for the rest of your life. Family, friends, and memories are precious as the diplomas you are about to receive. The diplomas you are about to receive tonight has your name on it. But piggybacking on what Kara said, there's a lot of other people's names should be on that diploma that helped you get here tonight. How many people in your 13 years of school helped you achieve that diploma? How many people have helped you receive all of your accomplishments? The names of your parents, grandparents, extended family, siblings, teachers, priests, pastors, all should be on your diploma. Sometime tonight, tell them thank you. When I was 18 years old and fresh out of high school, I thought I knew everything. When I had my own children, 
bells and lights went off and I started to think about all the people that have helped me get to where I was. Mark Twain once wrote, when I was a boy at 14, my father was ignorant and I could hardly stand to have the old man around. But when I got to be 21 years old, he said, I'm astonished at how much the old man learned in those seven years. <laughs> when you cross the stage tonight, you're not alone. All these people are with you and reach out to help you receive your diploma. Families are the foundation of our society. In our families, we find love, we find strength, and we learn values. Take care of your families. Appreciate them. Graduates, as the song goes, your parents and family have been the wind beneath your wings. Graduates, this is your day, and you should be filled with pride. As a parent, we may have said things to you that didn't make a lot of sense, but we always said things that we thought that we, the things we said because we still loved you. I think back to some of the statements my own mom and dad made that were just plain silly, but I always knew that they loved me. My parents taught me the following, logic, because I said so. <laughs> if you fall on, out of that swing and break your neck, I'm not going to take you to the store. Make sure you wear clean underwear in case you have an accident. <laughs> they also taught me irony. Keep crying and I'll give you something to cry about. <laughs> they taught me about osmosis. Shut your mouth and eat your supper. <laughs> they taught me about contortionism. Will you look at the dirt on the back of your neck? <laughs> they taught me about weather. The room looks like a tornado hit it. Besides the silly things that they said, they always made me feel loved. I truly believe, class of 2015, that your parents showed by advice, words, actions, similar ways of showing love to you. I have said thanks to my own parents. Um, I'm going to be presumptuous and say thanks to your parents. Frank, thank you for the times I messed up and you stood behind me. Thank you for taking me to the DQ or occasionally Cold Stone. Thank you for sharing all your experiences with me, even though I heard the stories 10 times. Thank you for not getting too mad when I got a ticket and wrecked the car. Thank you for helping with the paper and helping me study for a test. Thank you for the puppy. Thank you for teaching me right and wrong. Thank you for t reading me stories when I, was, I, when I was a kid so that I could go to sleep at night. Thank you for teaching me fairness and appreciation. Thank you for my brothers and sisters, even though I sometimes wonder about that. <laughs> Thank you, Mom and Dad, when you had your fights you both still told me that you love me, even though the two of you are not getting along. Seniors, the last thing of the thank yous you have to accomplish on your own. Some night, sometime tonight, say to those that loved you, thank you, and you fill in the rest of the sentence. Oh yeah, I forgot justice. My parents taught me justice. My parents taught me justice by saying, one day you'll have kids, and I hope they just turn out like you. <laughs> As a parent, I know the pride your parents and families are feeling. Accordingly, I would like all the soon-be graduates to recognize those who have made your night possible. The seniors, the program is being recorded. In about a week or so, it's going to be on TV. As I call upon you, please stand and remain standing. Grads, look towards the audience. To the parents that changed your diapers, fed you, clothed you, re nurtured you, worried about you, dreamt for you, prayed for you, and encouraged you away in ways you probably don't remember, but made it possible for you to be here. Parents, please stand.
Come on, parents, stand up. <laughs> Remain standing. Grandparents, come on, grandparents, stand up. The teachers in the audience, please stand up. The rest of you that helped raise these graduating seniors, will you please stand? Thank you very much. The diplomas you are about to receive are conferred by a Board of Education that has taken great pride in the quality of education that has been provided to you. On behalf of the Roseville staff, administrators, Board of Education, I wish each and every one of you the happiness of a productive life, the respect of the people you meet, and most importantly, that you have love of your family and give love to your family. Enjoy the Twizzler. Good luck and may your dreams come true. It's graduation time. So one more reminder, parents, please hold your applause and cheering during the section. This is a real small section. And then we'll give you plenty of time to applaud and cheer in between. Thank you. It is my honor to begin the roll call for the graduating class of 2015. In order to maintain the proper decorum of this event, we ask that everyone Please remain seated so those around you will be able to see the graduates receive their diplomas. The first diploma is given to the class valedictorian, Nathan James Richendaller. The second diploma is given to the class salutatorian, Kara Jean Hoffman. For the remainder of the roll call, we ask that you hold all applause until the last graduate of each section receives his or her diploma. Then we ask that you congratulate the entire section of graduates together. Will the next section Please rise and come forward to receive their diplomas. <laughs> Alan Joseph Adams. Charles Edward Allen, Jr. Megan Nicole Allen. Matthew Musa Altwal. Austin Tyler Ancona. Caitlin Tierra Appleton. Emily Ann Arteline. Autumn Madeline Arsenault. Brandon Lee Arsenault.
Brandon Michael Atkinson. Kevin Dennis Atkinson, Jr. Brittany Lee Baldez. Anthony Michael Ballerini. Akia D.A.J. Barnett Landers. Nino Vincent Basili. Jamar Beck. Larry Darnell Bell. Taylor Ryan Besco. Kyle Landon Billings. Laura Lee Binder. Justin Thomas Blackford. Brielle Lachelle Blackwell. Emma Janine Blasho. Natalie Bonetta. Nicholas Raymond Booz. Desante Boyd Reese. Anthony Joseph Bozek. Janae Ginny Bradley. David Richard Brandon. William Russell Brannon. Riley Suzanne Brinley. Jacqueline Helene Brohl. Carissa Nicole Broussard. Stephanie Alexandria Bubel. Please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diplomas. Tyler Jack Beery. Alexis Paige Bunnich. Chad Michael Burke. Abigail Grace Bussino. Joshua Aaron Calcaterra.
Siobhan Shanique Treasure Calloway. Antonio Lamont Campbell Jr. Jenna Lauren Campbell. Taylor Alexandra Campbell. Colin Richard Capshaw. Charles Matthew Carson. Stephanie Ray Chamberlain. Chua Chang. Mackenzie Judith Chapman. Victoria Marie Chapman. Justin Reed Czechlowski. Andrea Grace Chesney. Jennifer Christine Chivers. Sabrina K. Cisneros. Abigail Eileen Cleves. Brianna Janine Coder. Latea May Coleman. Alana Nadine Collins. Ashley Rose Conforti. Star Angel Cook. Zuri Sedai, Cordova Martinez. Dominic Anthony Cushino. John Alexander Coulter. Lorenzo Denio Cracciolo. Cynthia K. Tiana Crampton. Selena Leandra Denise Kerb. Madison Corinne Daniels. Alexis Victoria de Souza. Jacob Matthew Dean. Desiree Santina de Cesare. Ryan Michael Deshaka. Caitlin Janine Dickin.
please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma. Emily Elena de Grande. Adam William Dimmer II. Mackenzie Renee Donnelly. Toyana Joy Monique Dottery. Kai Oshanik Dozier. Mary Dreck. Demand Dunaway. Liliana Monique Dyer. Paige Lynn Edmonds. Sydney Renee Ellis. Andrew Kent and Sinas. Mercedes Jade Rosalyn Farley. Stephanie Farrar. Anthony Michael Farah. Matthew David Fetty. Evra Lee Fielder. Angel Ray Finzel. Yeah. Tiffany Rose Finzel. Yeah. Jordan Todd Foreman. Michelle Christine Foster. Ariana Nicole Fauché. Savannah Sky Fauché. Sheldon Andrew Fauché. Ashley Marie Frederick. Dominique Nicole Fresh. Tyler Michael Freshney. Kyla May Fullwood. Reina Marie Garcia. Ashley Rose Gaisley. Andrew Jean Geiger. Alaric Killian Gerstheimer Soybert.
Daniel Garcia Gibson. Brianna Leon Gonzalez. Hannah Marie Goodger. John Eric Gooden Jr. Isabella Marie Gordon. Jamal Denzel Gordon. Please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma. Trevor Scott Gornez. Brandon Lee Gorski. Elijahwan Devante Graham. Courtney Danielle Graham. Ryan Kenneth Graham. Rachel Colleen Green. Rebecca Lee Green. Madeline Marie Grego. Hope Nicole Grieve. Lexi Dion Griffin. Alexis Michelle Grimshaw. Joshua Hall. Brianna Dionsonique Hampton. Eleni Zoe Harolampopoulos. Jerissa Chazelle Harris. Kayla Sharon Marie Harris. Joshua James Hartman. Kayla Cheyenne Harvey. Vanessa Denise Hawkins. Joseph Mackenzie Heaton. Megan Elizabeth Hedmark. Alexis Brittany Heinrich. Yeah. 
Summer Mercedes Higgs. Davon James Hill. Brianna Kimberly Hodge. Dwight William Hauser. Dominique Michelle Huey. Samantha Lynn Huffman. Lasharie Ashanique Hunley. Jack Potris Isho. Dejande Elijah Irvin. Malak Fayez Ismail. Ashley Nicole Jackson. Crystal Noel Jackson. Christina Danielle Jacobs. Anastasia Jasic. Nathaniel Ian James. Kanisha John. Miranda Leanne John. Please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma? Annalise Joe Johnson. Londavian Edna Johnson. Amber Crystal Ann Jones. Cheyenne Taylor Jones. Miranda Corinne Julian. Kenneth Allen Juris. Justine Marie Ketchman. Claire Lynn Kastner. Wakila Dierica Kino. Taylor Renee King. Jenna Ann Kimowitz.
Joshua Curtis Knighton. Colin J. Kovelt. Pat Olniski. Pat Olniski. <laughs> Allison Kayla Katalinski. Andrea Tiffany Kraft. Dao Ku Gwininski Gwineski Brendan Thomas Gwineski Kelsey Alicia Labadee. Aaron Patricia LeBeau. Samantha Amber Lakowski. Keith Lewis Lampkin. Sheena Marie Lehman. Justin Alexander Levy. Tatiana Initra Lebeau. Nadarius Devane Lee. Tyler Dravon Lee. Walter Unam Lee. Michael Anthony Lapidi. Ayana. Ayana Dolores Marie Lipsy. Michael Jennings Lauren. Joseph Devin Lucas. Lauren Faith Lyman. Samantha Jane Lynn. Jeremy Dennis Lyons. Matthew Kane Mahone. Malik Abdul Mahones. J. Conrad Manfreda. And Brittany Cheyenne Mann. Please join me in congratulating these seniors.
Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma. Jared Alexander Manser. Kevin William Margrander. Michael Anthony Marquis. Sarah Virginia Marshall. Austin Michael Marsili. Kenneth Gino Marsilio. Brittany Janae Mann. Oh, Martin, I'm sorry. <laughs> Chelsea Namaya Martin. Dominic Matthew Martin. Jamie Leon Martin. Christopher Elijah Maccabee. Michael Patrick McConnell, Jr. Alicia Ryer Maggie. Autumn Sierra Meredith. Raymond William Matalski. Kaylee Patricia Millard. Jacob Michael Miller. John Glenn Mills III. Frankie Deshawn Mitchell. Christopher David Moon. Haisha Moore. Dewan R. Morris. Frank Norman Morris. Austin Thomas Morrow. Connor Allen Morrow. Brandon Alexander Mosley. Anthony Michael Trey Moss. Tyler Michael Muchik. Allison Paige Myers.
Caitlin Celeste Myers. Destiny Alicia Newman. Martavis Newson. William Nee. John Darrow Joseph Northington. Heather Marie Novak. Carmela Lynn Nowak. Chloe Mackenzie O'Banion. Taylor Janine Melzina Oldham. Devin Joseph Olko. Rachel Marie Orlando. Caitlin Christine Ortiz. Emma Rose Marie Asentoski. Sherry Elizabeth Packett. Please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma. Christopher Michael Parker. Joy Unique Parker. Stephanie Joyce Parker. Cheyenne Carol Pathiel. Andrew Scott Payton. Rico Germain Peck, Jr. Terrell Jordan Pennington. Elizabeth Starr Peruzzi. Corey Lee Peters. Joseph Ryan Patrone. Tamara Mary Fropper. Cassidy Lynn Phillips. Matthew John Pilato. Trey Austin, Dion Pippen. Catherine Ann Potberry. Brooke Sidney 
premier. Angelica Noel Proper. Wasim Kanda. Brianna Marie Ran. Fletcher Elliot Ramsey. Anthony Nicholas Ranke. Victoria Lee Reynolds. Jordan Ethan William Richards. Ariana Victoria Rickle. Regina Nicole Ritter. Chelsea Marie Roach. Tyler John Roberts. Again. Jarrell DeAnthony Robertson. Brittany Marie Robinson. Deshaun Shaheem Robinson. Rose Narasia Robinson. Jivanti Hevon Rogers. Tiffany Lee Rogers. Joshua Andrew Rolder. Rick Thomas Ronselli. Tanisha Ronnie. Please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma. Gregory David Russell. Eldridge Ahmad Rudd. Peyton Brianne Rudnick. Adriana Shelby Ruiz. Kaylee Elizabeth Rumfelt. Lanaya Monet Russell. Kayla Sue Sackrider. Deja Marie Sanchez. Katie Ann Sora.
Austin James Skelf. Austin Anthony Schaefer. Aubrey Janae Scheibel. Rebecca Janet Schmidt. Savannah Faith Shadowski. Samuel Arthur Sharati. Megan Lynn Schultz. Raven Shamia Scott. Alyssa Page Sellup. Mohammed Abdul Kareem Shanshal. Tyler Joseph Shaw. Taharka Shaw Richards. Alicia Michelle Shepherd. Nijah Marie Shropshire. Kian Martinez Simmons. Amber Rose Smith. Andrew Mitchell Smith. Audrey Lenore Smith. Sierra Janelle Smith. Micah Savannah Smith. Trey Marquise Smith. Tyrese Diamond Nancy Smith. Lindsay Aaron Samoski. Kyle Joseph Sonnenfeld. Destiny Martrice Steger. Brianna Elizabeth Stitchick. Alana Jean Street. Tara Nicole Tadia. Annette Valerie Tan. Anthony Scott Taylor. Travis Andrew Toy. Devante Patrick Thomas. Dejan Xavier Thompson. Nelson Frederick Thorne the Third.
please join me in congratulating these seniors. Will the next section please rise and come forward to receive their diploma. Brittany Denise Thornton. Jacob Daniel Tinch. Brandon Thomas Tregembo. Juliana Rose Tribue. Madeline Francis Trudeau. Krishela Ronika Vance. Christiana Raquel Vance. Christina Richelle Vance. Kobe Nia Vang. John Paul Verhagen II. Michael David Vervak. Joseph Ree Villamore. Sarah Marie Volmer. Michelle Catherine Waderlow. Michael Jeffrey Wagner. Brandon Robert Walker. Megan Lee Walkowski. Zachary Vaughn Walters. Hallie Ann Waters. Cody Michael Watson. Isaac Antonio Watson. Ashley Therese Watts. Christian Scott Welch. Matthew Joseph Welch. Tyler Michael Welch. Ashlyn Danielle Azalea Wethy. Tiffany Lynn Wisnat. Terrence Lavelle Whitman Gillespie. Benjamin Matthew Witt.
Cal Stone Willard. Jonathan Ray Williams. Sarah Rose Williams. Alec Michael Wilson. Delantre Shakur Montrese Wilson. Robert Francis Wilson. Taylor Karen Wilson. Charlie Page Wingate. Thomas Tyler Winton. Shelby Lynn Wolf. Brianna Wright. Zoe Savannah Wright. Kevin Shiyi Zhang. Kellen, Kellen Lee Gloria Young. Kayla Lynn Young. Brandon Scott Zagata. Jessica Lynn Zitka. River Brant Welshans. Shania Renee LaShawn Cooper. Please join me in congratulating these seniors. Traditionally, traditionally, one of the first diplomas given is to our class president. But tonight, our class president's last name begins with the letter ZU, and she has been last her entire life. So we decided that the last diploma given had to be given to our class president, Amber Spring Zundel. is an important transitional period. It's in high school that we experience the change from adolescence to adulthood. In the past four years, we've experienced love and heartbreak, and we've made and lost friends. We failed and we've pushed through, and we've succeeded. Coming in as freshmen, we were naive, immature, and scared, and now look at us. We've made memories with each other, some that are amazing, and some that we think we might like to forget. These memories have all shaped us into the people that we are today. Roseville helped us to grow up. We're no longer scared little freshmen. We're smart, responsible individuals, and we've made differences in each other's lives. We've grown together as people, and now we're here. We made it. After high school, we probably won't see each other again, not like we have for the past 13 years of our lives. And that's terrifying and it hurts, but it's been an amazing ride. 
We'll all go on to college or to work, and we'll make new memories with new friends. And it's okay to glance back, but you'll never move forward if your focus is on the past. We have to move on, and this isn't the end, it's the beginning. So, All right, uh, class of 2015, please join me in moving our tassels from the right to the left. <laughs> 